Hey guys, how's it going? MKS here. Um, this video, I'm going to show you how to play Skate Free on PC using the RPCS Free emulator. First thing you want to do is link in the description, go to this website, you want to download the emulator, hit download. You want to open the file, it will download. Next thing you want to download is Skate Free. You get multiple links here. You only want to click on this one, download now, hit that. That's just mad. Hit that. I'm not a robot. Robot. Click here to continue. Wait 10 seconds. Uh, you get your link. And when you get your link, which will be right there, you will get this file right here, which is a Google Drive file. It does not have a virus. It is 6.5 gigabytes. So you want to click that. You want to download. And once you download, you will get a raw file. Download WinRAW, link in the description. Now, with the RPCS3 file that you just downloaded, you want to create a new folder. I call it mine PS3, highlight everything, extract, and done. Next thing you want to do is you want to download this PS3 update. Link in the description. You want to hit download update. You want to open that, which is a .pub file and save it to your desktop or wherever you want to save it. I've got everything saved here. Now we want to extract the skate free file. Open with WinRAR. I extracted mine. I extracted mine to my desktop. You want to do that. I've already done so. Once you've got this, you now want to open up your PS3 file or RPS RPCS3. Open that. Uh, now you want to download the firmware update that we just updated, which is a .pub file. Mine is located on desktop. You want to click open, and it will start installing your firmware. Yours will take much longer as it will be your first time installing this. I've already installed this, so everything already exists, so there's nothing you need to compile. Next thing you want to do is you want to now load up your game. So you want to add game. Mine is located in your desktop, which is right here. Click that, select folder. Now your game's loaded. Your game will show up in your games list. Next thing you want to do now is you want to go to pads and you want to select the input that you're using. I recommend using the controller if you're using this um, emulator. You are playing PS3 games, so you can use Xbox One, Xbox 360, PlayStation 4, or PlayStation 3 controller, whatever. If you're using an Xbox controller, use X input. If you're using PlayStation, use DualShock 4, and so on. You get the point. I'm going to show you that my controller is working, as you can see here. Everything works. And now you want to go to config. Now this varies on your computer how this game will run. It's best if you use a very good computer. There is, um, I will put the recommended specs in the description below so make sure you read that to see if your PC can run. But you basically want um, to alter these settings um, for your specific system. On this system I'm running a GTX 960. You can copy everything on mine if you have similar specs. This will be set to default OpenGL. You want to use Vulkan and then select the graphics card you want. I'm selecting 960. I have my frame limiter on 60. 70, 720p resolution, 100%. Then you want to hit save. And then you want to open up your game. first time launch will be longer than this as it has to compile everything audio is definitely not the greatest bear that in mind And there you have it. Skate free, play for PS, well from the PlayStation 3 
on PC. There you have it. FPS does vary depending on your system and where you are in the game. As you can see, I am in uh, the Mega Park place, so FPS kind of goes all over the place from 60 all the way to 15. There's always someone there. There's always someone there. Skate break. There you guys have it. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Goodbye.